Hey everyone, welcome to Two Bears Outdoors. Well, it's a very windy day and we start off at Gilbert's out of Key Largo. We're gonna be heading south on the Bayside, going to a sandbar near Curry Hammock State Park. The cool thing about traveling the intercoastal is the opportunity to see some amazing boats. Oh, here comes a few. Check this out. All right, let's slow it down. How awesome is that? All right, let's slow this one down. We're traveling about 24 to 26 knots. The conditions, it's windy, the water's a little rough. Right now we're passing Isla Morada. That is the bridge that crosses over to the world famous Robbie's. One thing we notice when you're traveling the bay waters of Isla Morada, keep your eyes open for stone crab traps. There are buoys everywhere. And here's some guys checking their crab traps. We're almost at our destination. 11 more miles south, and we will be at a beautiful sandbar known as Marathon Sandbar. All right, guys, we finally made it. We're here. We finally made it, folks. Look at the water, look at the sand, the scenery. Beautiful place to anchor in your boat and enjoy the day out on the water. All right, that's Bear Bear. One thing that Bear does, it cracks me up. Um, when I'm walking in deep water or I'm swimming, he actually is able to hold on and grab my shoulders with his little claws. And he just holds on and he goes for the ride. little story on bear we've had bear now for almost two years uh, we had him when he was three months old bear was abandoned at a casino parking lot so while I was at work I received the call that there was a stranded puppy in the casino's parking lot apparently somebody dropped him off left him there all night so finally I was able to get him I took him along with me. It was going to be a long day. I had to travel to a different location in Florida and deal with an alligator call. So he was with me basically all day in the vehicle. It was on a Friday Memorial Day weekend. Our plans were to go out in the water, but we had this little tiny three month old pup. From all day riding with me in the truck to the next day, he was on the boat with us. He was such a good puppy, we decided to keep him. Uh, he is just a blessing.
So we had a great time out here today. Um, it's a little cool. It's not quite that warm today. I think we've had a cold front come through. Just our luck. But anyway, it was beautiful. And uh, the tide is kind of going out now. So we're going to back out of here and go find us a little anchorage for the night. It is freezing cold out here, freezing and windy. But I want to show you this really beautiful sailboat that's anchored about maybe 50 yards away from us. And it's just a gorgeous boat. So we have had a great day. We're full and tired. We just had our uh, kebabs and our nice corn on the cob so we're going to clean up our little mess and we're going to go ahead and just retire we're going to get in the cabin here in a minute and all of us pile up and try to get warm because we're all cold <laughs> morning everyone well we're ready to do this again seems like it's uh, overcast I know it's about maybe I don't know seven o'clock in the morning seems like the wind has died down a little bit but when the wind started dying down the bugs are coming out we noticed that we had a little bit of mosquitoes flying around so but it wasn't too bad so uh and get this day rolling First things first, gotta take Bear to go potty. <laughs> Good boy, Bear Bear. Man, that's a, you were, you were busting. Bear peeing in the water. Good boy, Bear Bear. Boy, look at that yellow cloud. I think we're just gonna hang out here for a little while, then from there, just head on back. We got a long journey. We've had a little bit of lunch and we're going to take just a little cat nap and then off to check our traps and it'll be time to go back to the dock and pull the boat out. So we've had a great couple of days, just didn't last long enough. So we're, hopefully we'll get to come back out again soon. <laughs> 